people have to understand that the population that is currently in prison, uh, you know, the average educational attainment is like fifth grade level education. So there's definitely a strong correlation between an individual's um, ability to obtain education and their lack of opportunity. And the, la the lack of opportunity somebody gets could potentially lead, lead them to committing crime. It is at our best interest to ensure that when people uh, are leaving prison, they have the tools that they need, again, to live responsibly. One of those tools is to be able to have as much education as possible. About 71,000 a year actually exit prisons. So what do we want in terms of public safety? Do we want people that are gonna exit with the tools necessary to live responsibly so that they won't commit crime again? Or do we want people that have not gotten the education that they need to be able to look for a job, have not gotten the treatment options necessary so that they won't go back into drug addiction and so forth? Um, what kind of person do you want living next to you? So you don't have to care about criminal justice reform, um, but you can certainly care about how much money you as a county taxpayer and as a state taxpayer is gonna end up paying uh, for housing an individual uh, just because their, their needs were not served through appropriate programming.